Welcome to Mytho Mastery. Before we start, take a moment to make yourself a cup of coffee and settle into comfortable place. The werewolf is a human with the ability to transform into a wolf typically during the full moon. The concept of the werewolf has been deeply ingrained in European folklore for centuries, and stories about these creatures have been passed down through generations. Werewolves were often associated with themes of curses and witchcraft. In many tales, individuals were said to become werewolves through curses placed upon them by witches or as punishment for sinful behavior. Other stories attributed the transformation to a demonic influence or a pact with supernatural forces. In many folklore accounts, werewolves having varying degrees of control over their ability to transform. Some stories suggest that experienced werewolves can master their transformations through practice, discipline, and willpower, allowing them to change at will or at specific times. However, other tales portray the transformation as involuntary or triggered by external factors such as the full moon with the werewolf having little to no control over the process. One well-known folklore story about werewolves is the legend of the beast of Gévaudan, which took place in the 18th century in the Gévaudan region of France. According to the legend, a mysterious creature described as a giant wolf or werewolf terrorized the countryside, attacking and hunting people over several years. The creature was said to be unusually large with reddish fur and a fearsome appearance. Despite efforts by local hunters and authorities to track and subdue the beast, it continued to evade capture and wreak havoc in the region. The legend of the beast of Gévaudan became infamous throughout France and Europe sparking fear with the idea of a monstrous creature roaming the countryside. Numerous theories and explanations were proposed to explain the attacks, ranging from supernatural curses to the presence of a particularly fearsome werewolf. Another folklore story about werewolves is the tale of the Loup Garou. In the wilderness of Quebec, Canada, there exists a creature known as the Loup Garou, which translates to werewolf in French. According to the legend, the Loup Garou is believed to be a cursed human who transforms into a wolf-like beast under the light of the full moon. The origins of the Loup Garou vary in different versions of the story. Some say that the creature was once a human who made a pact with dark forces or was cursed by a vengeful witch. Others believe that the Loup Garou is the result of a hereditary curse passed down through generations. Regardless of its origins, the Lou Garou is said to possess immense strength and agility, including the ability to heal quickly from injuries. This rapid healing is sometimes attributed to their supernatural nature or the regenerative properties of their werewolf physiology. As a result, they possess immunity to conventional injuries. They are preying on unsuspecting travelers and villagers who venture too far into the forest. It is believed that those who encounter the Lou Garou may themselves become cursed or suffer a similar fate, perpetuating the legend across generations. Despite efforts by brave hunters and villagers to track and confront the Lou Garou, the creature is said to be elusive and cunning, evading capture and continuing to haunt the wilderness of Quebec to this day. In contrast, Scottish folklore offers a different perspective with the story of the wolver. The wolver is depicted as a unique and kind-hearted creature. Unlike traditional werewolves associated with fear and danger, the wolver is known for its benevolent nature. According to legend, the wolver would leave fish on the doorsteps of poor families during harsh winters, demonstrating compassion and kindness towards those in need. This depiction of the wolver as a cute and kind-hearted version of a werewolf offers a contrasting view to the traditional fearsome image associated with werewolf folklore. One popular modern story about werewolves is the legend of the Beast of Bray Road, which originates from Wisconsin in the United States of America. According to the legend, the Beast of Bray Road is a werewolf that prowls the rural roads near Elkhorn, Wisconsin. The legend began to gain attention in the late 1980s and early 1990s when numerous sightings of a large wolf-like creature were reported by locals and visitors alike. The sightings of the Beast of Bray Road sparked widespread speculation and fear in the community, with some residents believing it to be a supernatural entity, like a skinwalker in the shape of a wolf or a cursed individual transformed into a werewolf. Others speculated that it might be a misidentified bear or a large dog. Despite various investigations and attempts to capture or explain the creature, 
the true identity of the Beast of Bray Road remains a mystery to this day. Werewolves are formidable creatures possessing immunity to normal weapons and injuries. However, despite their resilience, there are believed to be effective methods in defeating them. Silver in various forms such as bullets, blades, or accessories is commonly associated with werewolves as a weakness. Silver is capable of inflicting wounds that are difficult for werewolves to heal, making it a potent weapon against them. Additionally, wolfsbane, also known as aconite, is a plant believed to be toxic to werewolves. In some tales, exposure to wolfsbane in various forms, such as a potion or a weapon, can weaken or even incapacitate a werewolf. But where did the legend of the werewolf originate? Well, to uncover its origins, we have to delve into the realm of Greek mythology, particularly into the story of Lycaon. The tale of Lycaon serves as one of the earliest references to werewolf-like creatures. According to myth, Lycaon was a mortal king known for his cruelty and arrogance. One day, Lycaon decided to test the omniscience of Zeus by serving him a dish made from the forbidden flesh during a banquet. Enraged by this sacrilege, Zeus punished Lycaon by transforming him into a wolf-like creature, doomed to roam the earth in eternal torment. Over time, the curse of Lycaon became intertwined with other myths and folklore, creating the archetype of the werewolf we know today. And so, the origins of the werewolf trace back to the ancient myths of Greece. 